Hey, it's Bernie with Bags Unlimited, and I just finished showing how to assemble an aluminum frame to frame your record albums. Right now, I'm going to move on to the wooden frames. Uh, this is probably the best dis album display that we have. It is gorgeous hardwood. Let me uh, open it up here. It's gorgeous hardwood frame. It displays both the album cover and the record side by side. On the back, it's got hangers at the skinny end and two on the fat end so you can hang it either sideways or vertically, whichever you like. I'm gonna mount it sideways today. First thing you wanna do is lift up all these metal stays on the back. These are called flexible framing points. These make it possible for you to change the album that's being displayed as many times as you want. It's fully assembled at Bags Unlimited. Starting from the back to front, you have a mat board. The back mat, which surrounds the record and the album cover. The front mat, this one's black. It's got an angled beveled cut. You have instructions. And finally, UV protective plexiglass. There are two options here. This is the polystyrene. There's also an acrylic, which is, all, which is UV coated as well. It's about twice as thick. So if you want a little added protection, a little thicker um, glass on a plexiglass on your frame, you can go for that. Uh, first thing you need to do is remove the protective plastic protective sheeting that uh, keeps your plexiglass crystal clean. When you do it, you want to be careful not to touch the plexiglass. You want to, as much as possible, keep, keep it pristine. Keep all your fingerprints off of it. Hold it just by the edges. If you hold it by the edges, then any marks you have will be hidden by the bevel of the frame. Okay, so that sits down in there. Go ahead and place your front mat on top of the plexiglass. The next step is to place your surrounding mat. This keeps the album and the artwork centered on the facing mat. <clears throat> then you grab your album. Okay, we're going to put side one. Your record should be cleaned. I cleaned this for another video recently. It still looks pretty clean. Make sure that it's right side up. And it goes centered right on the mat. One of the great things about the Some Girls album artwork is they incorporated the inner sleeve into the cutouts of the outer sleeve to to make the stone spaces come through. It's interactive, it's revolutionary. There was nothing like it when this came out. I don't know if there's anything like it since this came out. Finally, you have your back mat. Place this down carefully. Make sure it's flat. And go through and push the stays down. The flexible framing points let you remove or change the album that you're displaying over and over again. You can lift them up and press them back. They won't wear out. And you can change your display as often as you like. Okay, once you've gone through, make sure all your stays are tight against the back. Lift that bad boy up and show it to the world. Look at that. That is a great looking display. You might find that the plexiglass can be a little staticky. One of the great things we use here is called Tiger Cloth. So it has carbon fiber, so it neutralizes static. It's great to clean. Doesn't scratch your plexiglass, but will remove all the dust and static from it. And there you have it. 
That is Some Girls by the Rolling Stones. Beautifully displayed. Hey, don't just listen to your music. Make sure you show it off too. Bernie from Bags Unlimited. See ya.